How do you engage your website visitors? You have just seconds to capture their attention, but how do you do it? Watch this short video to see how your business can. Hello and welcome to Triple Traffic Bots. In this video, we're going to be talking about the entire system. So it's vitally important that you watch this video in its entirety before moving across to the next videos. We're going to be talking about what Triple Traffic Bots is and why it works. Then as we move forward into the other videos, we're going to be talking about the system. We're going to be talking about the tools which are predominantly free. We're going to be talking about how you can do this and we're actually going to be discussing as we go through it what you actually need to do at every step of the way okay so let's move forward and start talking just briefly about the traditional opt-in funnel you may have seen this you may be aware of this you may have gone through it many many occasions as you've opted into different offers you've requested freebies um, and you will know this this route, but let's just talk about it, okay? Because essentially, the traditional uh, opt-in funnel is all about getting an email list onto your autoresponder so you can market offers, you can discuss things via email, etc. Okay? So as you can see on my screen, we've got traffic. Now it doesn't matter what the traffic is, but it's traffic. So it could be social media, it could be advertising, it could be blogs, SEO. Um, YouTube videos could be anything and we're driving people towards the opt-in in the opt-in you're you're uh, you're giving out a free gift you know a lead magnet uh, as long as they put in their name and their email address and you see they complete the form and by doing so their name and their address gets put onto the autoresponder um, and Typically what happens is that most people set up the autoresponder in this fashion. So it automatically, the autoresponder, when it takes the email address from the person, it automatically refreshes the page to a sales page and offer. And the, the idea is that, you know, it's something that's congruent with the lead magnet that they've requested. And there's, you know, there's a chance that they may be interested in this offer. Okay. So they send them directly to their affiliate link. But once they're on the autoresponder, you know, you can set up so the first email delivers the lead magnet that they wanted. And then as time goes on, you can set up broadcast emails uh, to send them towards other affiliate offers. So it's a very standard um, uh, funnel that many people use. Now, there are some issues with this. If we get no opt-in uh, at the if the person gets to the opt-in page and does not put in their email address, that's it. It's the end of the road. So the traffic, how you worked for it, or if you pay for it and they don't opt in, you've lost those people forever. Okay, and the rest of the funnel for those people is highly irrelevant. Now the visitor may be confused by the redirect. So as I said, once they uh, put in their email address, typically they're not sent to the download page. They're sent to a 
different offer and that may confuse them and then they may not check their email, they may not bother with the offer and again, you've lost them for good, okay? Next thing is they may not check the email. Even if they, they look at the offer, they're not, whatever, they might not realize that they're meant to check their email address, okay? Then we've got the, um, we've got email deliverability, deliverability issues, which we, we know that autoresponders are fantastic. They are the number way, number one way of, you know, creating business online, but deliverability is very up and down, very up and down. So this funnel in a nutshell is poor value for money because you, you generally just have one bite of the cherry um, and if they're not, if they don't go on your list, you have lost them for good, okay? So let's start looking at the triple traffic funnel. Now it's a much bigger funnel because a lot more things are going on, okay? But we will talk about it. Uh, try not to get confused immediately because I will explain it in depth. So as you can see, as always, we start with traffic. And again, it could be anything. It could be social media, it could be emails, it could be SEO, blog posts, YouTube, whatever it is, okay? And we're driving them to a landing page. So, so far, it's exactly the same. Now, the difference um, with our landing page is that we don't have an email. We not we do not have an email capture on that first page. And the reason why is because we have a button that connects to Facebook instead. Uh, and that is something that, you know, sometimes initially people can be quite wary about giving their email address. If a button just comes up and says, we're going to send you something on Facebook, people are going to more likely are going to click yes. So as you can see, this moves across to click button. And what happens is, is that what we do is we set it up with a service called ManyChat, which is a free service. And what we do with that in ManyChat is we set an automatic Facebook Messenger reply, just like it would be an email autoresponder, but it's in Facebook. And this happens instantaneously. So they're on the landing page, they click the button, it automatically opens up Facebook and it sends them a Messenger message, just like it's one of their friends. Okay, so again, you know, people are more likely to read this because we know that deliverability of messenger messages is almost 100% and open rates are about 80%, whereas emails are somewhere between 20 and 30%. So what we do is we send them a very nice welcome message on Facebook in the messenger and then we tell them that if we if you want to download the lead magnet that we promised you on the landing page, click on this page. And then the page that opens is a page that's almost identical to the landing page. And on the, this page, it says, where can we send, where can we send the lead magnet? Then they need to put in the email address. And because they've gone through this funnel of Facebook, they're more inclined to give you your email. They, they feel like we're on a, a friend basis, okay? So they're gonna put in their email address, okay? By clicking on the complete form that we've got here, that's beneath it, and it's gonna go across to the autoresponder. It's gonna connect with the autoresponder, and then what we do is we set up the lead magnet to be delivered in the first email from the autoresponder. But we move from the autoresponder up to the bridge page. And this is like what we spoke about with the uh, traditional funnel that we automatically, as soon as they've gone through the form, they get sent to uh, you know, an affiliate offer. What we've got is a nicely designed page that explains to them that the lead magnet is arriving in a few minutes. But in the meantime, please check out this video. And we've got a video that's all about an affiliate product, there's a button, and then they can click that and jump across to the affiliate offer, okay? So we've, we've had that chance we've, to get them to the affiliate offer in a much more friendly manner um, at the, whilst we've been getting them onto our list um, and delivering the lead magnet, okay? And then in time, because it's on the autoresponder, we know that we've got the broadcast emails and series which we can then send other affiliate offers. Now that's fairly similar. It just has one extra step to what the usual uh, two extra steps, two or two different tweaks, the bridge page and the fact that ManyChat delivers the email capture, okay? But this is where we get the massive twist, okay? And this is how we get the triple traffic, is that 
we have the opportunity to register with Facebook to send uh, subscription messages. Okay, so we go back up to the top with ManyChat connected with Messenger and sent the email capture page. We have the opportunity to send further messages and redirect them to other pages on our website. Okay, and then we can uh, we can promote other offers. Okay, so we've got two bites of the cherry there. Okay, and this can continue in you know, continually, okay? And then the third element is that when we, on, on all of our pages, we connect it up to the Facebook pixel. So we're pixelating every single person. So if you remember when I spoke about the original, uh, the original funnel, opt-in funnel, if they don't opt in, we lost them for good. With what we do here, because we pixelate them, they are not lost, okay? They go onto our pixel from the landing page, um, and then what we can do is we can send them adverts later on the line saying, are you sure you didn't want to opt in for that? Are you sure you don't want this product? Um, we can then create lookalike audiences and send, you know, additional people that are similar to the people that we've, we've already targeted and send them offers. We've got all these different ways of, of, of driving traffic to offers and, you know, building these different types of lists where we can market to them, you know. So this traffic that we had at the start is 100% maximized. We're not losing money on this traffic because we've got so many chances uh, to to talk to them, to speak to them with these offers. And, and as long as we're driving them back to our site, we can also have adverts on our sites for other things like Google Ads, you know, and then we can make some revenue back as well, okay? And this will help us to pay for the advertising that we're getting in the first place. So what we're gonna do now is, I'm just gonna show you um, the pages of a typical example that we're gonna go ahead and create, create in the subsequent videos, which shows you um, how this funnel works. Hi, so this is the walkthrough example of the triple traffic bots. So as you can see, this is the first page that you send people to whatever your traffic is, you send them to the first page. And you can see it looks like a traditional opt-in page, but it doesn't have the email capture that most people would send straight away. We've just got the button that says get access. So I'd note that by going to this page, you're being added to the Facebook pixel. So you'll be able to target ads to these people later down the line. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on get access now. This should connect up with Facebook and send us the welcome message. So I'm gonna continue. So you can see here, we've got the message that's come up and it says, hey there Dave, Hope you are doing awesome. I see you want my five tips to success. Just click below. P.S. If you ever want to unsubscribe, just click stop. Okay. So these were the messages that I sent and you can see it's a nice friendly message and it says visit my site. So I'm just going to click on visit my site because that's the button that's been uh, I've created. And you can see now that we've been sent to the email capture page, which looks similar. So the, it's congruent with the first page. Okay, and as we've come through Facebook, people are more willing to enter their email address. So I'm just gonna stick in an email address here, and then it will show us what the next page is when we click send now. So you can see that I put in the email address and it automatically redirected me to this page, which again is uh, in a similar design. It's congruent with everything we've seen. And you can see at the top, it says attention, your free ebook will arrive in the next 15 minutes. Now we've set that up in the email. So that's gonna be, that will, that will be sent instantly via the autoresponder, but we're saying it's gonna turn up in the next 15 minutes because we want them to look at this page. Okay, we don't want them to just say, forget about this. This is the mistake that most people make, that they send them to an offer 
and they're like, what is this? This doesn't make any sense. We're saying it's going to turn up in the 15 minutes. And then we have a call to action. We're saying, in the meantime, for those who are serious about making money, basically check out this. And we have this video here. And we set it up in a way that they can't see what the video is. So you know, if they are interested, they're going to click the play button, okay? And they're going to be able to play, um, play the video, okay? And this will just turn up exactly how it would from 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 your video okay and then beneath you will have the button that goes to the affiliate link okay so we don't need to click on that okay but what we do is the as we said the ebook will run next 15 minutes so i'm going to jump ahead to my inbox and check out the email uh, and we'll see what that's like so i've just jumped into my email account so i can check the email uh, after we opted in to the at the list on the email capture page and we can see that we've got an email here from the address that we set up now it's important to note that the vast majority of all responders require double opt-in so what this means is that you opt into the list but then they send an email to the person that opted in to say basically are you sure you wanted to opt in so what we do is we set up a, a specific message and you can see we said, please click the button below to confirm that you'd like to receive the lead magnet from TCC demo. Essentially, this is a demo, but you could put anything you want there. Um, so to make sure that people click confirm my email. And once you click confirm email, you'll receive uh, the subsequent emails. OK, so it just comes up and says your subscription was confirmed. Please check your email. So let's just go back to the email, click on the inbox and you can see that there's a new email at the top there your five tips right here we'll click on that and it's got the message from me uh, that I drafted out and we've got the the message to download we're going to click on that and it's going to open up the download page you can see once again it's congruent with everything you've done with the big download button there so they can download the lead magnet okay so that is the basically the pages of what we're going to be setting up in this um, course but well, we're going to be talking about all of the other bits and pieces. So make sure that you go through all the videos that show you how to set these up, how to link everything together, because the linking is the key. Um, and that's the things that you may get tripped up upon. So make sure that you watch this. Make sure that you watch the introduction where we go through the funnel in depth. And we talk about all the different elements. It's not as confusing as it looks, particularly you now when you just see this walkthrough, it's very, very simple. And the pages that you can create the way that we do it look fantastic so thanks for watching this video and we'll see you soon thank you for watching our video i hope the information we present it shows you our excellent service so what are you waiting for take action now 